Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about how I set up my Canon camera. I'll be talking about how I set it up to shoot photos and how I set it up to shoot videos. This breakdown is going to be fairly simple as there's not much to explain, but I do get asked this question a lot regarding this topic, so I figured I'd make a quick video and explain you exactly how I set up my camera. When it comes to photos, I like to always shoot in RAW. This gives me the ability to edit my photos in post a lot more than if I were to shoot in JPEG. So this is a no brainer for me. Now when it comes to white balance, I actually like to manually set this depending on the location. For the most part, I tend to lean towards a warmer image for my shots. So I will shoot between 5,000 and 6,500 Kelvin. If I'm indoors, however, this will drop down into the 4,500 range. Aside from the temperature, I also shoot in a picture profile that is called landscape. I like this because it gives my image a bit more of a contrasted look. Last but not least, in terms of autofocus, I just leave it in the circle mode and turn on the eye detection mode to get a really crisp image. Now moving on to video. When it comes to video, my go-to settings to shoot is always 4K 60 frames per second. This allows me the ability to slow down my footage if I want to, but it's also a high enough resolution to create movement in post-production in order to give my video a little bit more of a flow. Now in terms of white balance, I follow the same rule as when I am shooting photos and shoot the temperature manually and follow the same settings. However, in terms of picture profile, I always shoot in Canon C-Log3. This is essentially like shooting in a very flat profile and it gives me the most dynamic range to edit the colors to my liking in post-production. Following the picture profile, when it comes to sound, I also like to set it to manual and adjust it based on the scenario that I am in. It is very easy to jump into a menu and increase or decrease the recording level based on how loud it is. I personally always aim to be lower than 12 decibels in order to get the best audio quality. The only other two things I do when setting up my camera is turn on two features. The first is the histogram. This is crucial for me to expose my image correctly. The best advice I can give here is that when you're looking at your histogram, you should try to maintain a bell curve. Last but not least, in order to compose my shots properly, I have a 3x3 grid display to be able to compose my images exactly how I want them. It also really, really helps me when I'm shooting hyperlapses. Well, that is a brief explanation of how I set up my Canon camera in order to shoot the shots exactly how I want them and get the best results possible, both with photos and videos. I hope you guys learned something today and I'll catch you on the next one.